Good morning. Uh, it's me again, Lewis. Standing in front of what I call Spaghetti Alley. It's a very small alleyway with some really decent graffiti. And I'll take you on a tour. Yeah, so as you can see, this is probably the one spot with some of the best choice graffiti anywhere in the city. I'm going to zoom out a bit just so you can get a better view of it. Yeah, and we do have some pretty talented graffiti artists here in this city. I have no idea what happened here. I'm hoping someone will come in and put some new work, but time will tell. Yeah, so as you can see, some really nice pieces in this alleyway. Uh, it's pretty decent. It's not a big alleyway like Graffiti Alley in Toronto, but still some really amazing works here. And here is a staple as far as uh, food goes in Canada. Or not Canada, but in London, Ontario. Spaghetti Eddies. Yeah, and right behind here just some more stuff behind London Music Hall. And as you can see, some pretty decent pieces around here. Also, along this alleyway, this is probably the best looking piece there is. Oh, uh, the Rick and Morty piece. Yeah, so as you can see, we do have some pretty good talented graffiti artists in London. It's a killer looking skull that definitely know how to use a spray can. And some of the pieces are very, very well done. Because this is a very small alleyway, this tour is going to come to an end. Now, if you kind of like what you see here, um, by all means, like, subscribe, follow. Uh, that's pretty well all I can say. Um, there, every so often on my Instagram page, I'll try to go out of my way to find decent uh, graffiti to photograph, post it. Uh, but I just thought I'd come here do a quick little video just to show you what we have here in Spaghetti Alley as I like to call it uh, just you know just to see just to give you an idea and a bird's eye view of what we have um, as you can see yeah I'm pretty well done here so like I said like subscribe follow please leave a comment also if you do get a chance just before I finish things off at these guys they have really good pasta and it's a nice place and the staff are always good anyways this is where I go sign off it's not quite 8 in the morning so I'm gonna go and look for a cup of coffee before I go to work